Um, I've been in a really dark and difficult spot lately. Imagine having her sit. Welcome back to another to another video. Today is Saturday and I'm doing a family vlog. We're about to go out and have some brunch at Panera Bread. So follow us around today. Alright, we're just now leaving Panera Bread. It's um, about to be 12 o'clock. We're gonna go and walk around um, downtown for a little bit before they take a nap. We have about an hour to just walk Mama. and see what they have. And then we're gonna go home for the nap. Mama, do it to my deal. What, baby? Mama, do it to my deal. We're going right here where we go when we go to the farmer's market. Well, like nobody's gonna get in or out, so it doesn't really matter. We have to walk like three blocks just to get there because it's not packed and the streets are all blocked off. Don't touch, no touching, no touching. Where are you gonna put it on? Yeah, the window in the car. <laughs> Pull over. Okay. 
All right, I wanted to go ahead and let you guys know we made it back home. It's a little after two. Um, Jedi is taking a nap. Ayla should be taking a nap soon. My battery is about to die. So I just wanted to quickly tell you guys, we um, made it back. It was very busy and packed, as you guys saw. A lot of people, we had to park pretty far. And it was a nice sunny day out, or it is really sunny today. So when we got home and changed the kids, we saw that they were both kind of suntanned. And so next time we need to make sure we start putting sunscreen on them because it is getting warmer out. Um, but yeah, Paige is probably gonna take a nap. I think I'm gonna go watch some um, Love Island. I just recently started watching it. I'm not sure how I feel about it, but I probably gonna just watch that. Like I said, Ayla's still awake, but she's gonna be taking a nap soon. She took a small nap in the car and pretty much half the time we were there, but she's up right now and she'll probably take a nap in the next 30 minutes or so. So I will check in with you guys when the kids are up and when we're all got a little bit more energy because we're pretty tired right now. I forgot to mention that we typically go to that little event. It's basically a swap meet with a bunch of shops and food and rides for kids and stuff. And we usually go every year if we make it. We'll either do that or we'll go to Vintage Days, which is like another similar event, but at um, the local college. And we don't really go to like buy anything in line. The only thing we did end up buying was Jedediah wanted this little 3D sticker of the Hulk that you guys probably saw me showing. Um, we went back around and bought him that. And that was it. What? What, Ayla? Okay. Is that what happened? Yeah. Yeah? Okay. Thank you for sharing. So, um, we've been basically just hanging out in the living room. Um, Jedediah is watching a movie. Ayla just had a bottle. He just fell asleep on the couch, basically. And um, I actually have like a lot of energy today to go out because I think it has to do with the sun. I like just once we got home, I was like, okay, the kids could take a nap and then we'll leave. But long story short, neither of them have taken a nap. Jedi went in the room for a little bit, woke up, came back in the living room, said he wasn't ready for a nap. And so I understood because it was already like two something and usually he takes a nap between like 12 and 1. And so he, in that little 15 minute nap he had in the stroller, probably threw him off. And so he didn't take a nap. Um, and then Ayla, she's probably getting sleepy, barely now. And so I'm going to probably have her take a nap soon. But anyways, I wanted to share with you guys. Ayla. I wanted to share with you guys something I've noticed. And I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys have noticed. But um, in California, it has been raining for the past like month pretty much all of March it rained it feels like and there was a few barely rarely days that it didn't rain and I really get affected with the rain I love I enjoy the rain but it's just like my seasonal depression hits harder when it is raining and the sun that has been out today and yesterday has really helped my mental state because just being stuck in the house during rainy days is not the best and I did utilize like the time still like I went in the garage one of the days and like we painted while it was raining but I don't and I still run errands and go out when it's raining but I just don't enjoy getting outdoors and doing things when it's raining and so that has been really hard for me mentally especially with the additional factor of us going down to one car so on days like Pedro had the car for work I would be home not stuck but like you know home with the kids especially when it's raining i don't know i just felt very restricting and so now that we have some really nice weather it's just making me feel good it's making me want to be out and i'm just glad the weather's getting better and it's just starting to feel like spring <clears throat> and then the other thing that i wanted to talk to you guys about which is just my thought process of things that i'm really excited for um, if you guys don't know, Ayla's turning one this month, so t this is her birthday month, she'll be one on the 12th, and I want to do a couple things. So one, I actually want to go out and find some, um, cake pans, like the little round ones, because I want to make her a homemade cake for, not homemade, but I'm just going to buy the box, but I want to make her a cake for her photo shoot which I think I'm going to do next weekend or tomorrow. I don't really know because I have photo shoots for her birthday and then I have a photo shoot, Easter photo shoot I want to do with the kids. And so I really do want to <laughs> make her a cake so she can do like a little smash session. And um, 
I need a but I have a bunt cake and I also have like the rectangle cakes but I want to make circular cakes because I want to do like a two or three tier cake and then just put icing on it um, so I need to go to the store I want to go to the store for that and I feel like I know we could do it tomorrow but I don't know I just have the energy we're already dressed I just want to go out today and get that stuff and then I also wanted to go to Hobby Lobby or Michael's to get like some greenery to go with the background either for their Easter pictures or for her photo shoot and then lastly what's been on my mind this just today because of this amazing weather Ella, get your little leg down um, has been wanting to get the kids back in some sort of activity so not really back in because Ayla's never been in anything um, but Jedediah has been in swim and he's been in and he's taken a ninja class let me see these Ayla. he's also taken a ninja class so I was thinking of what should I have him in this summer I'm thinking basketball or baseball but I can't find any classes that are available or open registration yet for that but I'm thinking of doing him in basketball and baseball or one or the other and then I want to get Ayla and swim and I saw that there's a swim class that starts on the 15th and I was thinking that would be a cool birthday gift for her to do like spring summer um, swim class and then later on get her into like a little gymnastic tumbling class and so those are kind of like the two sports that I have on my heart today to kind of get them in and look up prices and stuff and so I wanted to share that with you guys because I feel like this weather is just opening my mind to feel so much better and excited for the summer and just like the rest of this season. I don't know. Um, I've been in a really dark and difficult spot lately um, with like my mental space when it comes to like life right now. I could go more into detail on a different video but just wanted to share those things with you those things have been on my mind on some things that we might be doing later today or coming up and so i will keep you guys updated as far as what else we do today and if i end up enrolling them in anything so yeah all right last thing for real like as far as like me chatting um if you did not know and i feel like i say this all the time but like no one really knows me or anything but um i have recently attempted to take my photography skills a little bit more serious um i've always enjoyed taking my kids pictures and like like pictures in general like i've taken maternity pictures and um graduation pictures and so I really was just now this year I finally like actually am attempting to be more serious about it and like put myself out there like if anyone I know is wanting their pictures done like charging and things like that and so with that I'm just taking these like her birthday pictures the Easter pictures I just want to take them more seriously and what I'm going to be doing oh I actually got a backdrop stand and my first backdrop um I don't know if I shared my Christmas photos with you guys, but I can insert a picture. I created the whole backdrop and the decor for it and everything, and I took our Christmas pictures this year, or last year, and so I'm really going to have fun finding props and like um, different things to just kind of make the backdrop look nice for her birthday photo shoot, to their Easter photo shoot, and then I'm actually doing two shoots for her. I'm going to take her 12 month pictures probably next weekend and then on her actual birthday I'm going to do a photo shoot with her in her birthday outfit and so um, I'm excited about that and I think I'm going to vlog those shoots just because um, I want to look back and kind of see how I improve over time and different things that I can incorporate into my photos um, but yeah I wanted to share that because I don't think anyone really knows but I do have an Instagram if you're interested and would like to follow me to support. It is Mo to the Lynn Photography on Instagram. And I um, don't have very many followers, but I don't I also don't have very many um, photos uploaded, and that's just because I have only had like one actual session. Um, I had another one scheduled for next week, but it got postponed. Um so yes. If you're in the central California area feel free to let me um, take out photos because I, I want the practice on other people other than my kids because it's already hard taking kids photos so yeah all right I'm done chatting <laughs> bye guys okay so it is almost six o'clock and Jedi and I are here just hanging out I pulled out my Nintendo switch to play with him or to show him he's kind of getting frustrated I think he's a little too young for it but 
Um, it's been fun just kind of playing with something that I used to play when he was literally in my tummy. Um, Ayla is asleep. And so is Pedro. And so I'm going to be waking up in the next 10 minutes or so. I'm just going to wake him up so we can get out of the house for the rest of the evening and be out before bedtime. But Ayla's taking a really late nap and this is like her only real nap. Her other nap was like 20 minutes. So just have to update you guys because it's been a minute we finally made it back outside after forever waiting for the sleepy heads over here now i got jodaya addicted to this game huh daya huh okay scoot over hey guys we made it to our next dest destination don't take it off take it off Mommy wanted to take a picture of you, Dad. Okay, give me the game back. Then put the hat on. Oh, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. Hey, look. We're at Hobby Lobby. I want to try to find a few things, so hopefully we can find what I'm looking for. In here. Oh. I want some of these crates for Ayla's photo shoot. They're 22 bucks, but they are 50 percent off. So eleven dollars each, but I want like two or three of them. I don't know if I'm gonna do it, but they're cute. I'll probably paint them a darker color. They do have white though. This little stool is so cute. Imagine having her sit. But how t this thing is so tiny. Sixteen bucks, so it'll be eight dollars. Okay, so far this is what we have. I think I'm going with these three crates. These are the same size. This one's a little smaller. The stool, and then these two Easter baskets. Found these on sale for seven bucks each. Okay, so I just kept walking and I found some a better color. Kind of like these colors better. Because I feel like with this gray that I would end up spray painting it or painting it. And so I kind of like these two, but there's only two. I wish there was one more size. And there's no price tag on these. $14.99. I think I'm gonna get these ones. I don't really want this color. So I, I just remembered where they would have different letters because I don't really like this white one and I did not like a solid black one. So there's solid white ones here. But it doesn't seem large enough. And then they have these over here. That's way I could paint it if I want. I think I found the one. I think I want this one. This is a better size. Alright you guys, we are back home. It's 8 o'clock. Um, my kids actually don't eat sa like burgers like that, so I'm going to make my son something to eat. They're going to eat dinner. I'm going to make Ayla a bottle and get them ready for bed. Let me quickly just show you what I ended up buying because I kept going back and forth between a few things. I ended up getting these two baskets. They were I got these three different size little wooden Crates. I got this little mini, don't mind my kitchen, it's a mess. Got this little mini stool. I got the A for Ayla. And then I got one, the word one. And I'm kind of annoyed because they were actually out of O's. This is a zero. So we're gonna just make that work because I'm not going on a hunt. And that's everything I bought. And literally everything except the baskets are for her shoe. Um, I kind of wish I could have gotten some greenery or flowers, but they were not on sale. And if you don't know, artificial flowers for some reason are expensive. And so we'll have to catch them on another time. My kids are currently eating, so I'm going to go get their pajamas. So once they are done, I can get them ready for bed.
Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.